Hey guys. So today I'm going to show you um my Lego Woolworths Unlock that I made in the past couple days. It's not actually totally done. Um but I've had most of it done. Um so we're going to start on the American side. Um, and we're going to move on to the German side. Anyway. There is an M4 Sherman on fire. And then there's this guy with a one by one plate, red plate on his uh, chest. Because he got hurt when he was in that fire. Um, then as you can see up here. In front of this house, I'm about to talk about that. There is three Americans charging. One of them is dead on the floor. Didn't make it. Um, mouse came, took his chance, trying to eat him. But probably this mouse will get shot, so not that happy for him. Um, but if he's smart, maybe he'll get, get away by now. Um, so, um, then there's this house. Um, as you can see, there's a little sniper guy in there. There you go. So, I will turn the mock around, but for now, it's a pretty big mock, so I just want to kind of, um, make it stay like this for now. Um, then there's this Jeep. I think I use this in another mock. I mean, I'm going to use this in another mock. Um... And, uh, I know usually people don't use stuff in a mock two times, but, you know, this is just such a cool Jeep. Um, that I'm thinking about building another mock, and I think that that mock will have this. Because, like, I wanted some kind of, um, vehicle. And this is basically all I have as a vehicle. I mean, I could use that tank but you know it's a little too big i'm i'm going to be building a mini mock next time so um then um so that's basically done for the american side also just want to tell you guys um i did like kind of like lay down um some of these pieces so like one by one studs um t slopes one by one plates and a bunch of those just everywhere um like one by one tiles um you know a lot of stuff in there i also did add um well i actually am not done with the american side i missed this guy um it is a little dark over here i think i'll just come in I only have one lamp, sadly. So, that's that guy. He's firing at that bunker. So, I can turn that off. Um, you can see there's some um, bullets whizzing on the ground. And those are from the Jeep over there. And those are from this bunker. So, as you can see, there is a gun firing at a bunker. There is a guy in it. I just need to open the door. Can't really see him here. Of course, it would be dark in there. Yep. So there's that guy just firing in there. I wanted to use that guy because he's white. You know, there would probably not be that much white guys in there, so I just wanted to kind of hide him. Um, I had no other guys really, so yeah. Um,. But I wanted to show you anyway. Um, so, I guess we should move over here. Let's go around here. Alright. So, you can see there's some bushes right there. And there. Um, there's some, there's a house right here. I didn't really finish this roof, roof part. And I only laid, um, another wall in this side. That I see it from this angle. So you can see there's a sniper over there and there's a sniper in here. 
And they're both making like a competition with each other. And obviously they have to fight each other anyway, so. Um, then there is this medic carrying this guy into this destroyed building. I think um, I put out a review of that. Um, so uh, then there's this guy right in here, right next to them. If you cannot see, you can't really see. I'm, I'm going to just get the flashlight. So you can see that he has a black one by one stud on his hand. And he has a pistol. So I'm pretending he's loading it. And then you can see the destroyed building. I think I already set out a review of that. And then the bush. And then another guy. He's shooting right at these guys who are charging he's trying to take them all out one by one um so you can see that this anti-tank gun right over here um has been blown up i think that would be by the tank but then the tank got took out and that explosion took out that guy dead on the ground right there um then this guy's kind of fleeing and he's trying to make it to the bunker for cover um but right now this guy doesn't really care if he gets killed right next to the bunker that guy he's just trying to take out this whole thing right here this house these guys you know he's just trying to kill them um the machine gun fire will do something but he knows that torpedo launcher do much more um but except that is called a bazooka not torpedo launcher but you know that's just another word for it um so you can see that this whole bunker thing is on this hill uh i already set out a review of this bunker probably you guys remember seeing that um i did use Fewer brick for in here. For any of the other ones, I just use plates, like that one on that side and that one on that side. But this one, I actually did use filler brick. Most of the time, I used one by two. Uh, I mean, no, three, two by three, two by three bricks. Um, yeah, I used all, all of those were in there. Sorry, knocking down. Many figs over here. Um, so yeah, I just had to make that go up with filler brick. Um, I, it's not like I ran out or anything. I have a lot of filler brick, if you can see. Um, this is definitely not all my filler brick. Um, I probably have like, I don't know, 10 big bins more. Same size, but... Still have a good amount of filler brick in it. Um. So. Yeah. Um. This is just the first video. I'm gonna, um, update you guys later. Maybe I'm gonna do another video of this. If I'm able to get this thing done. Because I actually wanted to do it all along the mock. And if you guys just imagine that. It would look really cool. And if I'm able to gather up a lot of those um, T slopes, one by one tiles, one by one um, studs, more of those, and if I am able to get them all along the mock, then I'll update you guys later about it. And yeah, so bye guys. See you guys next time. Um, maybe if I do another update or if I get it all done, um, please like and subscribe comment below and I'll see you guys next time.